Understanding the rise of COVID flirt variants, what you need to know. The landscape of the COVID-19 pandemic is constantly evolving with new variants emerging and altering the course of the virus's impact. One such group of variants that has caught the attention of virologists is the flirt variants. These variants, named after their specific mutations, are becoming increasingly prevalent and may shape the future of COVID-19 management. But what exactly are these flirt variants and how do they affect our ongoing battle against the virus? 1. What are flirt variants? The term flirt variants refers to a family of COVID-19 variants that have independently acquired the same set of mutations. This phenomenon, known as convergent evolution, involves mutations at specific positions in the spike protein of the virus. These positions, 456, 346, and 572, play crucial roles in the virus's ability to bind to human cells and evade the immune system. To stem the science behind flirt mutations, mutations at positions 456 and 346 eliminate key antibody binding sites, helping the virus evade the immune system. However, these mutations also reduce the virus's ability to bind to human cells. The mutation at position 572 compensates for this by enhancing the virus's binding efficiency. This combination allows flirt variants to effectively infect cells while avoiding detection by antibodies. 3. Immunity and protection against flirt variants. Individuals who have recently recovered from a JN1 infection, the predecessor of flirt variants, are likely to have strong protection against these new variants. The minor differences between JN1 and FLIRT variants mean that existing antibodies can still recognize and neutralize the virus. However, those who were infected with older variants may not have the same level of immunity. 4. Vaccine efficacy in FLIRT variants Current COVID-19 vaccines, particularly those based on the XBB1.5 variant, still provide some level of protection against FLIRT variants. However, the efficacy may be reduced due to the specific mutations in these variants. As immunity from previous vaccinations wanes over time, there is ongoing debate about the need for updated booster doses, especially with the emergence of new variants. 5. Potential Surge and Public Health Implications With the rise of flirt variants, there is a possibility of a new wave of infections. Although the definition of a wave has changed, with fewer hospitalizations and deaths compared to the early stages of the pandemic, vulnerable populations remain at risk. Public health measures and personal precautions play a critical role in protecting these high-risk groups. 6. Preparing for the future. Vaccine formulations and public health measures. Decisions regarding the formulation of updated COVID-19 vaccines are crucial in addressing the changing landscape of the virus. The World Health Organization, WHO, and the U.S. Food and Drug Administration, FDA, are closely monitoring the situation to recommend the most effective vaccine formulations for the upcoming seasons. Additionally, individuals can protect themselves by staying informed about local case rates using at-home testing and following public health guidelines. As we navigate the evolving challenges posed by COVID-19, understanding the implications of new variants like FLIRT is essential. By staying informed and proactive, we can better protect ourselves and our communities. Don't forget to share this information, subscribe to our channel for more updates, and leave a comment with your thoughts and questions. Together, we can continue to stay ahead in the fight against COVID-19.